This is the Emergency Medical Minute, sponsored by Mile High Ambulance. Just a very truly, very quick medical minute. I was going to do something very brief on ketamine, something on just ketamine dosing. The way I think about it is kind of there's like a symmetry in it and the numbers are 0.3, 1, and 3. So it kind of like it's easy to remember that. So 0.3 mg per kg is pain dose. 1 mg per kg is dissociative dose. So when we're going to like intubate someone, that's usually the dose we use. And then three mg per kg, does anyone know what that dose is going to be? That's our IM dose for acute agitation, meaning like to go to bed now for someone who is like dangerously agitated, who needs to get like a critical stat head CT for a worry of a brain bleed or who's like dangerously agitated, threatening staff. So that's the IM dose. So 0.3 for pain, one for dissociation and three for agitation. The other thing I'll just mention is between 0.3 and one, that is the recreational dose. And that's where someone is like gonna be, you know, at risk of having K-hole kind of bad adverse reactions. So we always wanna go either 0.3 or a little less, or if we're, again, we're gonna try to innovate them one or higher. So that's just a quick little rundown on ketamine dosing and kind of the doses that I, uh, and indications I think about them for. Um, does anyone have any questions or comments? Yeah. Can I be conscious of the nature of the type of dose you use when you're not gonna put it in your way? So then what, what would your inclination be? What would your guess be? Like near one, but maybe under a little bit, because you want them to be breathing. No, so I mean, uh, they should still be breathing, honestly, at that one dose. Like, so that's the benefit about ketamine is that they should, they will be dissociated, but still preserve their airway reflexes. So we would probably do around like one mg per kg. Yeah. And it's a great question. Any other questions or comments? All right, great. We'd like to thank our sponsor, Health One Continental Division, and Swedish Medical Center for their financial contributions to the EMM. Donations from them and listeners like you make it possible for us to fulfill our mission of producing and spreading free medical education to the masses. If you enjoy our show, please consider making a one-time or reoccurring donation to help cover our operational costs and keep the EMM awesome. Click on the link in our show notes to make a donation. Thank you for listening.